Hi, here's your financial tip of the week. Now we all know what has happened. July 31st, all of those bonuses of the $600 additional unemployment compensation that everyone has received that got laid off, um, those have ended. And now the government is looking at extending those till October. However, they're looking to reduce it to $200. So first of all, I hope you really did a good job knowing you got that little windfall and you manage your money extremely well. The other thing is, is I want you to not be too proud. Uh, there are hundreds and hundreds of thousands of different food banks that are supplying meals and food for you and your families. So allow those companies that are like Omni is a, a hotel chain is a good example. I know many churches, I know our church serves 1500 people a day right now. So take advantage of those things, manage your money so well, and then you've got to have a routine. It is called time management. Every single day you should wake up with one thought in mind and that is what is the most important thing I can do today to find that new career? to find that new job. And it doesn't matter what it's in. Is it pharmaceuticals? Is it manufacturing? Is it telecommunication? Is it the financial industry? Is it insurance? Anything and anyone you know in those the industry you want to be in, you need to be calling. And again, what's the most important thing you can do? And you need a routine. Every day do the same thing. So maybe it's, you know, you're in, early in the morning when you first get up, after you have your meditation, after you say your prayers, after you read a devotional, the question to you is, what is the most important thing I can do today? And you should meditate on that maybe. But you do that thing. And it, it's sometimes very hard. It's so easy, you know, just update your resume. It's typing. Um, going on LinkedIn, again, typing, reaching out to people, very important, but sometimes making that personal phone call, and that's a harder thing to do. So you need to write a few little bullet points, of, of, and you say the same thing every time. And when something starts resonating with people, you want to call a friend and say, hey, you know, uh, my unemployment ended. I'm not going to be brought back to my hotel chain. Um, I'm looking for a new opportunity in the hotel industry or in another industry. Decide what it is and put some bullet points and say, I am looking for a career opportunity. I am looking for a position in this particular field. Be very specific and then call everybody you know because you don't know who they know. You never know who a person knows. So make the phone calls. That's harder and that's why I always recommend to do it first thing in the morning and no later than nine o'clock you make that phone call. And you never know. I had to make a really tough phone call just this last week. And I and I follow my own rules and my own routine. And I made the phone call first thing in the morning. And I cannot tell you how fabulous it was. It set the tone for the whole day. And the guy actually was going to hang up on me. He says to me, I said my, my name and the name of my company. And he says, I'm not interested. And he start, you could hear him fussing to hang up the phone. I said, whoa, 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 wait, wait a minute. And he said, yes. And I said, oh, well, I should have led with, hi, this is the Financial Diva. And he started laughing. And so that broke the ice and we just had a great conversation. So make sure you make it fun and you don't feel tense and stressed about it. You know, make it as fun as you can. That's why I say make some bullet points, you know, for an opener. Say, hey, look, I know everybody in the world's calling you, but I'm really special. Say something that is going to get you noticed more than the next person because Millions of people are looking for jobs right now, but you want to stand out. So get your resumes done. Look for job fairs. Those are usually held late morning and the early afternoons. Go to the job fairs. These are things that you can do, and I just call it good time management. You want to do, and wash, rinse, repeat. Do the same things every day. Decide on a ritual, a routine, a process, whatever you want to call it, but set it up and do it every single day. All right, go out there, do it. I know you can. If you need some encouragement, call me. I'll, I'll get you pumped up so you can make those phone calls. Uh, until next time, please make sure you subscribe so you get our bi-weekly uh, financial tips and business tips and just life tips. Until next time, like and share and stay safe.